Hi, everybody. Um, we are sitting here with uh, my good friend, my compatriot, um, a fellow musician, uh, great Finnish pianist Oli Mustonen. It's always such a pleasure to, to work with Oli. We, we have worked together many, many years and, and uh, you know, playing with a friend is, is always such prestige and, and, and such, a, such a wonderful thing in this profession. This kind of connection that we have, I mean, it's a lot of communication just uh, musically and, uh, and of course it has a lot to do with the fact that we know each other for a long time. But I don't think it's only that. I think if I met Hannu for the first time, and we started working on the Prokofiev, we would have the same connection. Sibelius First Symphony is one of the best first symphonies anybody has ever composed. The First Symphony is special because um, that's the only symphony where you can hear that he was influenced by somebody else. He was influenced by Berlioz, he was influenced by Tchaikovsky. I think Sibelius is one of the greatest symphonic composers of the 20th century because he chose to be a, a symphonic composer at a time when Symphonic composing was not really the most, um, let's say, popular thing to do. Debussy claimed that symphony is dead and Schoenberg was bringing music into entirely another direction and Stravinsky was doing his own things. Um, but Sibelius, he belongs to the old symphonic tradition but entirely in his own way. Today we started working on this wonderful work, Prokofiev's second concerto that we played. But I think he is one of the most irreplaceable composers. I think, you know, if he had become a doctor or a lawyer and not started to be, be a composer, uh, I must say my life would be different without Prokofiev. I think he, his music is somehow totally irreplaceable. It's so personal. There's always this kind of freshness and uh, also a lot of humor. It's a work associated with the great world of, of Russian fairy tales like Firebird of Stravinsky or this Kashe, the immortal of, of Rimsky-Korsakov. I'm very happy to bring this collaboration to Singapore and um, I hope that you will enjoy that too.